Hello. These instructions are for installing the dado wall kit. This kit is suitable for a span of 2 meters. However, it can be cut down for shorter runs. If your run is greater than 2 meters, you will need additional kits. Before you begin, please ensure you have all the components listed. Make sure you have the right tools for the job. You will need a tape measure, a pencil, a level, some adhesive and also a nail gun. Measure 912 mm up from the skirting. Draw a horizontal line at this height across your wall. This is where the bottom edge of the dado rail will sit. For the gaps between the panels, first, measure the width of the wall. Each panel is 515 mm across. Multiply this by the number of panels. In this example we have three panels. You will then need to subtract the width of your panels from the width of your wall. In our example we have three panels, this means we need four gaps. Now divide the value by the number of gaps to give you the width of each. First, measure from the wall and draw a vertical line from the top of your skirting to the bottom of your dado line. From that line, measure the width of a panel and draw another vertical line. Repeat this process for each of the gaps and panels until you reach the next wall. Please remember, the measurements in this example are for a 2 meter span. Ensure you use your own wall measurements. If you are using more than one kit, then a simple way to work out how many gaps you will need is to take the number of panels and add one. So three panels will need four gaps, 10 panels will need 11 gaps, and so on. Next, we'll mark the horizontal lines that will locate the top and bottom of the panels. Measure down from the dado line and draw a horizontal line from wall to wall. Measure up from the top of the skirting and draw another horizontal line. To check it is correct, take one of the longer panel strips and hold it up to the lines to see if it fits. Apply adhesive to the back of the dado rail. Align the bottom edge along the dado line and check it is level. Then secure it in place with a nail gun. Apply adhesive to the back of the wall panel strips. Starting at the bottom left-hand corner, line up a pair of strips with their corresponding lines. Once aligned, secure them with the nail gun. When installing the next two strips, first nail the two ends as circled. This will allow you to line up the last mitre correctly. Once aligned, secure the full length with the nail gun and wipe off any excess adhesive with a damp cloth. Repeat this process for each of the panels. Once all your panels are on the wall, fill any gaps and joints with decorator's cork, wiping away any excess with a damp cloth. Once the cork has dried, sand it to a smooth finish then you'll be ready to paint. Once it's painted it'll be time to stand back and admire your work. For inspiration, ideas and our product range, visit our website.